All right, don't mind, don't mind the messy room, but here is part two of the review of Alienware's full 17 R3s, one late 2015, and one just recently freshly built in 2016 for me. Now this one here, obviously my favorite. Just because it has the GTX 980M, 8 gigabytes, and oh boy, you can tell the difference. Now this one here, I can run. It still is a beast and a great laptop, and it plays Tomb Raider excellent. Now here's this one. All right. Background for that one, just so you guys can see. Oh, and it looks like this one just ran into a problem. So, this is why I got sent this new one actually. It's because this one kept having this problem, and another problem where the display driver kept flashing up in the corner. Which the display driver was right here. And this one actually had pop up, but I updated the driver and that stopped. So that's good. But back to this one. <clears throat> so it will run Tomb Raider and 4K settings at low to medium settings, but it will not go to old server because it needs at least 4 gigabytes of graphics. That's why this one, my favorite, 8 gigabytes of graphics. I'll go ahead and launch Tomb Raider here. It's actually my first time ever launching it, so let's see how fast the PC wants to set it up and launch it here. Mind, I did load Tomb Raider because it is a large team on the terabyte storage, not the solid state drive. So it's not loading off a solid state drive either. Alright, so that's pretty fast. First time load. Let's play it. Alright, so that's pretty fast too. This other computer to my left is still it's rebooting. your email. Oh, I've already done this. We'll skip this. Let's click the Steam so hopefully it's loading right here. Right there. So let's get right in the game and let's see how it looks. Now obviously this camera won't capture the full effects that my computer can get, but hopefully we'll be able to see the difference here as I load Tomb Raider on the other PC. Already you see all those great colors. At the other one does display as well, so let's get some running in. Alright. The hair movement. Up close in the face. Alright, now let's check on settings. Options. Graphics. We're on high right now. Very high. It says 16x. I don't know my phone is not the greatest. Hopefully we get a better camera soon here. <laughs> Working on it. And display. 
Right on 4K. 3840 by 2160 or 2001. You know, 60, 60 hertz is what it's going at. If I had X split, we told my friends for a second. This one's probably holding the steady 55 without the graphics amplifier. This one usually goes from about 55 to it drops to about 45 on average. It's having a problem loading steam for some reason. It's weird. Alright. And this one is asking me for a login. Oh, because I'm on the same account. I get it. Okay, well, this one is working now. I must realize that I was on the same account yesterday and I locked linked both of these together. Hey, this one is asking for my login actually. So we'll watch this one while I log in. Now on this one it still looks very good, but I mean you notice a little bit less detail, less sharpness. And you tell me what you notice. I I noticed that. This is obviously a cutscene, so it probably looks a little bit better than the actual gameplay. Frame per frame per second wise. Both of them still. 